Hello and welcome to our lesson on multiplying with fractions. So we're going to multiply 3 quarters by 2 thirds. To do this we're going to use cross simplifying and cross simplifying means you look for a factor in the numerator of one fraction and the denominator of the other. And you can see that 3 is a common factor of both. So we divide both by 3. And in the other pair, 2 is a common factor of 2 and 4. So we divide both by 2. And now we have 3 divided by 3, which is 1. 4 divided by 2, which is 2. Multiplied by 2 divided by 2, which is 1. And 3 divided by 3, which is 1. So we have 1 half. For question B, we have 3 fifths multiplied by 4 ninths. We're going to cross simplify, which means we can divide this numerator and this denominator by 3, because 3 goes into 3 and 9. And the 4 and the 5 have no common factors, so we'll leave them as they are. So now we have 3 divided by 3, which is 1 over 5, multiplied by 4 over 9 divided by 3, which is 3. And we have the numerator, which is 1 times 4, and the denominator, which is 5 times 3, 4 over 15. Do you want to try and work out question C and D by cross simplifying? You can pause the video and resume it when you're ready. You can see we can cross simplify the 2 and the 4 by dividing both by 2. And the 3 and the 5 don't cross simplify. So we, we have 2 divided by 2, which is 1 over 5, multiplied by 3 over 4 divided by 2, which is 2. So this is 3 over 10. Question D, we can divide the 5 and the 10 by 5. The 6 and the 7 have no common factors. So we have 5 divided by 5 over 6, multiplied by 7 over 2, which is 7 twelfths. Okay, let's try some more questions. So do you want to try and match the blue card with its correct green card by pausing the video and you can resume it when you're ready. Okay, so we have 5 over 6 multiplied by 1 over 3 and these will not cross simplify. So we have 5 over 18. So this card will match with this card. And next we have 2 thirds multiplied by 3 quarters, we can cross simplify with 2 and the 4 by dividing both by 2 and we can cross simplify the 3 and the 3 by dividing both by 3 so we have 1 over 1 multiplied by 1 over 2 which is 1 half so this one matches with this one moving on we have 7 over 12 multiplied by 2 over 5 we can cross simplify here and here, divide both by 2. So we have 7 over 6 multiplied by 1 over 5, which is 7 over 30. So these two also match. And finally, 3 over 8 multiplied by 1 half. These do not simplify, so we have 3 over 16. Okay, thank you very much for watching and I hope you found that useful. Thanks again and take care.